Hey guys, welcome back here. It's Captain Birch, and I am here to tell you that we are doing the flags. I'm going to show you all the flags, and I may have a cut in here because I have to leave soon, but uh, I will show you all the flags. So, to start us off, you have just how you make a simple banner. You do one stick with six of whatever type of wool you want, whatever color I mean, and that makes... Uh, the banner that you want but um I will say that it's like a sign thing then over here we have our first banner which uh, first style of banner which is a brick banner and all this does all this takes is one banner of any of your choice with uh, a brick added to it and the background is the color of your banner and then the brick will be uh, black always unless you want to add a dye to it and then um, this is uh, how you make the little dye in the middle you put um, the flag at the bottom and the uh, dye in the middle it just makes a little dot looks like Japanese flag and then uh, you can combine things by add by having this flag then you can add like a brick to it to make that and then if you come over here you put uh, your banner down in the side over there and then if you just put a line going straight across it you have this or you could do uh, make an X on the crafting table and stick the flag anywhere that's not inside the X and you get that or you could make a little cross good for cathedrals or churches or anything like that you just make a plus sign on the table and put the flag anywhere and you can uh, mix and match these to make a letter I thought that was pretty cool you can mix and match it to make different shapes but then you come up here and there's a um, simple recipe for what it does uh, it's just three of the die in the top corner um, this can be top or bottom, um, left or right, and that changes where the um, half that it is at goes. Uh, everything here is vice versa. Like you could uh, make this go the other way and have the cross on the other side, or you know just anything like that. So everything here is vice versa, um, including this, which I got the thing wrong on. So let me fix that real quick. Uh, la -da 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 -da. And so just a straight line. Everything uh, is vice versa, but it's also very, um, for lack of a better word, it's very symbolic. Like it's easy to figure out, except for some of these, like this one right here. Um, this one's really weird. You have to put the banner in the middle and then uh, the die around it and it makes this little loopy thing that would be good for a curtain. We're going to skip over this one. I will come back to it guys. Don't worry. And uh, now over here um, we have a banner and you can make you can color half of it. Again the vice versa recipe. Um, color half of it by just doing that or you can make just a straight line now this is not a third of it this is like an eighth of it I don't know why they did that but then uh, you can like go across the ball as well then if we come up here you can make a little triangle like a racing car thing just by making a triangle then um, this is a fairly simple one I, I should have put down there but um just one in the cor one die in the corner will make that little dot and that's how you do a lot of the uh, um, line things then over here not this one uh, this one you can also mix and match things like okay so um, you have this little dot over here and there's one over there that I'll show you that makes the stripes then if you just like put them together like that it'll make like the American flag or whatever you want I mean it's a really cool thing that they added but uh, it's really simple 
So then over here you can make a little border by surrounding the banner and die. Then you can make stripes. I, I thought this one was a little weird. All you need to make stripes are two on each side of the banner. And then you can have it go fade. It can fade. It goes uh, from the top to the bottom. I Yeah, this is stuck like this. You can't make it go uh, from bottom to top fading. I don't know why that one in particular is, but now we get into the fancy flags. So we showed you how to make a banner. And if you add, this one's extremely expensive, but come on. Who would not want that? I would give up all that gold for that. So to make the Mojang symbol, which for some reason this flag is called a thing. I don't know why. But if you add a notch apple to a banner, it makes the Mojang symbol. Then if you come up here, if you add a wither skull to the uh, flag, you can get the uh, wither thing up there. And you can put dyes with, um, uh, you can put dyes into the thingy my bobber whenever you're, whenever you're making a design, you can put a dye into it to make it that color. But, um... Also, to make a uh, flag a different color, you do not necessarily need that type of wool, but you can surround the whole thing in that type of dye, and it will give you that. But then down here, we have... You can even combine things like uh, the border with the creeper face, and you're thinking, well, what good is that? You can't get a creeper face in survival. I will show you the uh, thing that you can do to that do for that in a little bit but it's extremely hard to do so uh, all that is is you add a creeper face to a banner and then if you want the little border around it you can make a border flag and add the two flags together or not even the flag you can add the uh, yeah yeah you, you have to add the flag never mind never mind I'm going crazy and uh, then over here, if you add an oxygen daisy to a flag, it makes that. And if you want the uh, thing to be bolder, because over here, you can see, you see how it goes dark green, lighter green, and light, I mean, dark orange, uh, light orange, and lighter orange? Well, you can fix that by just adding a bunch of them. You see, there is no uh, variant shades of black here. It's just straight up dark black all the way through you just add a lot of that dye or whatever it is like you just add a bunch of the daisies and it makes a really bold version of it so now we are going to go over here I'm sure you were wondering why I have a redstone torch and why there's this over here the, sir sir that is rude that is rude you're ruining this excuse me Thank you. Okay, so, guys. The fix to the, um, creeper face. So what you... Dang it. Fine, I thought I was gonna do something really cool, but I got a dropper instead of a dispenser. Will you stop it? But I got a dropper instead of a dispenser. So let me, real quickly. Do na 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 I named them all test subjects as well. Now you cannot get something like a cow face or a, a spider face or ocelot face or anything like that from this. Oh, he has a little shovel. You can only get things that already have, uh, oh, there's no point in keeping the redstone there. Uh, you can only get things that already have faces in uh, Minecraft. So like the wither skull or creeper, any of these guys. Even your own head, I believe. If you believe you can achieve. Let me real quickly do that. Do that, and that, and that, and that. Fix this. And then, um... Let me come over here where there's a bunch of creepers. And check this out. This is only for creative people. Sorry. Like, no!
Hold on, let me lightning. I did that wrong. Uh, let me come over here where there's some creepers. And I think they realize that I'm about to summon lightning because a lot of them try to run away. But let me lightning bolt. There we go. Got him. Okay, and now if we blow them up, like so, there is a chance that we will get someone's head. Yes, no, maybe so. No, I don't think we got anyone's head that time. It's a small chance, but it's a chance. So maybe we got someone's head this time? Yes, yes, maybe. Uh huh, uh huh. I don't. Oh, there it is. We have a skull. Skeleton skull. So it is a very small chance, but there is a chance that you will get a, uh, a head from that. So I think that's really cool because I always wanted a head like that for my series, but I can never really get it, so I'm glad that Jeb added that in. And also guys, Jeb did all of this. Je I think he was thinking of the fireworks thing when he did this, but he did all of this. And um, if you are doing the flags, there is one thing I would suggest you do not do. If you take this, and uh, this and this one second one second there we go and you add them all together one two three Hold on. it looks extremely ugly you can barely make out what it is look at that I don't see why you'd want to do that but anyways, guys, I think that's going to wrap it up for this episode. I realize it was short, but tutorials are supposed to be short. My last one wasn't for some reason. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed. Um, leave a like, comment, subscribe. Uh, oh, and uh, leave, a leave a comment if you enjoyed my new headset. I just got a headset. I wanted to come record with it. I think it's amazing. But anyways, guys, uh, leave a like, comment, subscribe. And most importantly, stay afloat.